I'm gonna get right into it because I'm really excited for this one. This one's pretty special for me. This is the world's first NFT inspired restaurant. I thought that was pretty dope that someone out there would fuse the world of blockchain and delicious food into one and welcome me to film it. Oh, I had such a great time. This is Bored and Hungry in Long Beach. I hope you enjoy. Hey guys, welcome back to another Robert Report Street Edition. Today I'm in Long Beach at Bored and Hungry for something very special. For a limited time, the NFT world will be fusing with the physical world for some delicious food. Let's go check it out. Bored and Hungry was inspired by one of the most popular NFT projects to date, the Bored Ape Yacht Club. The apes you are seeing here are collectively valued over $300,000. The owner of these apes, Andy Nguyen, purchased them only a few months ago and immediately put their IP to work by launching the world's first NFT-based restaurant. Uh, we bought the Board Ape Yacht Club um, character, and when you buy the character, you're, they grant you the IP rights. And with the IP rights, you can put it on t-shirts, use our restaurant packaging, and you get to keep all the royalties. I've never seen anything like this. I've been in the restaurant industry for eight years, and this is something completely different, and the hype on it is through the roof. We, we, we're slated to open for 90 days, but with the hype that's going on, we might go a lot longer. We've also been inquired by other people to open in Dubai, uh, Japan, and Australia. Whether you're cynical or extremely hopeful on the future of crypto and NFTs, one thing's for certain, these smash burgers were juicy, delicious, and totally worth the hype. I'm super excited. I've been waiting for almost two hours. Wow. Yeah, so I want a burger and some fries and a drink. Definitely bored and hungry, waiting in line. I'm starving, can't wait to taste these burgers. My mouth is watering, waiting for it. To get a taste of the digital world, and some Bored Ape made smash burgers. Be sure to visit Bored and Hungry in Long Beach, but go soon before the pop-up closes. Yay, that's great. You did so good. I had a great time filming, guys. I was like, I was like, I was like oh my God, like all these uh, cool like, NFT things were there. Um, Bored and Hungry is an NFT project, as you know. They launched like in 2020, I believe, and it was one of the fastest growing po uh, projects ever. Uh, it's worth so much money now, but you have like the likes of Tom Brady, Justin Bieber, all these celebrities who are part of the community. And uh, this is the first person to actually create something for community members well, with this restaurant and whatnot. So if you're interested, uh, you can follow them on uh, Instagram at Jess Bored and Hungry. Hungry. Um, yeah, really good food, good good burgers. It, it was a blast. I want to ask you, you eat a lot of smash burgers. How was that smash burger? How did it rate? It, it was up there, man. Pretty yeah. good. I, I would put it right between I, a little above Shake Shack, but probably. Mm, I, 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 right it's up, pretty Chris, good. Above Chris, Shake Chris, Shack is a pretty good burger. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. I was going to put it up there with Chris and Eddie's a little bit. So, oh, yeah, I see. that type of vibe. The vibe, uh -huh. yeah, for sure. Yeah, Very yeah, fun. yeah. So, Chris just got a uh, golf. Thing, and on the box was a bored ape. Really? Like a picture of one. Okay. So does that mean the person who owns it leased it to this golf wear company or some agreement to use must have been made yeah. on their product? Because the licensing has to be, uh, unless or the person owns it. it. Yeah. Or, the, or the golf, golf company. company. Yeah. 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 Precisely. Because I Precisely. looked up the number, it's a four digit number, it was like 4,000 something. And it was said it was last traded for like three hundred thousand dollars. Wow. wow! Yeah, yeah. See, so there's crazy. numbers to it. Yeah, there's and they were like, "Wow, we spent three hundred grand on this. We better figure out some way to make money." <laughs> put it on, it's on every day. Day. golf <laughs> merch. We put it on golf merch. We can write it off. Yeah. Somebody will buy it. Yeah. Hey, um, really quick though, uh, he initially said ninety days. I think they're there permanently now, so don't wow. don't feel rushed to go. Uh, but it is in Long Beach. Uh, but it will be a new a permanent fixture of the community there. So I love good. that. Very cool. All right. 